Hey, what is going on, guys? Jason up here. Back again, this W900 Dell. Uh, it's a 2001 Kenworth uh, W900 or W900 Dell. Uh, it's a project truck, actually. Uh, we take stock stuff off, put custom parts on it. And you can probably see it's pretty custom, but it's not custom enough. <laughs> But um, it's got a Cat 6 and Z, 3406E. Well, I think it is. It's either 3406E or 3406B. But it got 150 gallon fuel tanks with a uh, studio sleeper. If you don't believe me, it's a studio sleeper. There she is. <laughs> uh, got the chrome light panels, got LED lights. Uh, we changed all the original lights out, put in LEDs in. We got the light bar down below the tank. We got LEDs. Same with the steps. Uh, the steps. There. <laughs> they're hammered. They got all that fish eyed stuff. And, you know, all that crap. I mean, it got a decent shine to it, but you know, I may get them kind of like the wheels and stuff. I uh, got daylight doors. I uh, got the chrome trimming. Looks pretty dang good. Um, yeah, this happened a couple weeks ago. Well, the big bubble. Obviously, what the hell? Yeah, you kind of see it, but I don't know what happened. Get some water got into it. Nope. The reason why we put tape right here because the water kept going and it kept expanding out. But it looks like a little cut right here went through it. Same with this one. Right here is bobbling up a little bit. Cut right here too. And that right there, I guess there's a rock hit it right there. But <laughs> it sucks. Um, got five inch dual exhaust straights. Straight pipe. Right there, boy. Man, something right there got some noise to it. Oh, yeah. I don't know if we can get the camera up there. Oh, yeah. Oh, uh, uh, yeah. Uh, paint job is uh, called Hawaiian Orchid. Well, this truck is not, well, it's really honestly a 2000 model, but it was actually getting built. December the 31st and that was like I think it was only a couple of minutes to 2001 a year I uh, got Kenworth wheels um, these are the original wheels everything on this truck is original original just about except the lights uh, you got the chrome back here man shit the shiny honey we changed all that lights out here put LEDs in we had black solid black flaps kind of like the trailer but they kept getting torn up so we put it the Kimworth style back on and a couple more years probably we'll put the black ones back on uh, got the Kimworth quarter fenders those are our original toolbox Stainless steel air breathers. Got LEDs in. You need to try to get that pot as possible off. Got three mirrors on each side of the truck. I uh, got the stock visor for now. Pretty soon we're going to probably put a drop visor. Uh, we got five, six, and ten bullet lights on the top of the truck. With the old school round air horns. Come on to the front of the truck. I uh, got a chrome bug shell. I mean, the wings on the side. Brand new rock guards. We decided to take the old ones off because, you know, they was kind of getting like this, all faded looking. I'll show you the difference now. Yeah. <laughs> That's a lot of difference. Uh, these little chrome trim things, we got them stains right here. But we have one over here, but 
I'm guessing it decided to leave town. <laughs> Got a brand new bumper. Uh, was in Florida, held deer, and it bent this side all the way in. She broke my light. But this right here, it didn't actually broke it, but yeah, that piece of metal was going across the road and I hit it. I had to get that fixed pretty soon. Love this eagle right here, man. God, dog. Got the eagle license plate holder. Brand new light bar. Same beat. Go on, somebody. Little front hole. Brand new light bar. I'm gonna have to get this front end polished so keep that shiny as heck. See that down there, so they. Yeah. So I gotta get with you in a minute. Pretty soon, gonna be uh, putting a Jones hood on. Um, hey. That's a chrome trail around here. This side's actually started to peel and bubble up too. Which we painted. Well, I'm gonna talk about what I wanna do to this truck in the next video. Right now, I'm just showing you what we got on this truck. We got the LED lights and exhaust covers. We got to show you on the other side. Uh, this side, if you notice the other side and this side with this cross, it kind of, the other one is shorter. Which I'm guessing when he painted these pinstripes back on, I'm guessing he forgot where it stopped. <laughs> this side just got a little step on it. These stupid leaves. Man, go on. Uh, and also, I forgot to tell you, we got a uh, black, um, what do you call it? Fuel tank covers, which. Me, I don't like fuel tank covers. I just like for the whole thing to be chrome, in my opinion. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but be, believe it or not, um, my dad I actually ordered this truck how he wanted it to be. So I think they've done a really good job on it. But when he first bought this truck, it didn't have all the lights of chrome. The only thing it had really was just just a standard camera bumper, uh, which had the two little fog lights on the sides. And uh it had the lights for the breathers, so it didn't have the chrome, it was just showing the black. Um, they had that light bar. My dad actually had this light bar on four or five, five trucks he owned. It still looks like brand new. Yeah, you can see the difference for sure. <laughs> see, like, you can see right here, that's actually where the paint used. You can probably see the way how it um, used to come down to. I don't know if my camera can show you. But, I don't know. I mean, it still looks good. I mean, ain't gonna nitpick it, brother. Uh, I'm gonna show y'all the trailer real quick. The trailer's a uh, 2012 utility. Got a carrier's unit. I don't like the size skirts in my opinion, because to me, I don't believe in fuel mileage. Like the, well, I kind of do, but at the same time, man, they just take this up way too far, these new trucks and everything. I don't like the way how they look, like that T680 in that Freightliner. Me, I'm old school, I love the W900s and you know, trailers all that good stuff man yeah see these are the type of flats we usually have on the truck so these ones are thicker though like these ones don't ask curl up as bad so next time we put the black ones on we're going to get the thick ones on pretty right now though the trailer is pretty standard 
stuff the only thing is really custom we did change these out to the chrome ones it was it was the black ones on uh wheels a little custom we put the lug nut covers on that we had on the other trailer that, that's pretty much it yeah but to me i mean if i want to you know get good fuel mileage i mean i ain't gonna buy me a dang truck just for dang fuel mileage i'll put me a dang wing on top you know the chrome wings you if you know what i'm talking about then yeah but my dad had them on his other truck he wanted to put on here but got to fit because the truck he had well, it was a green one I mean, it was an old, older truck, man. I mean, it had a flat windshield on it. Different kind of sleeper. I think it was a 93 model Kenworth W9. But, uh, yeah, anyways. Um, this is going to be a part one, part two video. Maybe a part three, because I might talk about how I'm going to run the business and how I'm going to run everything. Man, I mean, I love this thing, Brad. We get comments all the time about this truck. Right. So yeah, guys, um, follow me on my uh, Facebook. My Facebook name is Jake Smith. My um, Instagram is Jake Big Rig. Yeah, it's either Jake Big Rig or Big Rigs large car so, uh, yeah y'all hook me up and if y'all want to know more information about the truck you know just text me and or call me i ain't gonna give my phone number out here <laughs> so you just text me on facebook or something and uh i'll tell you all about the truck and yeah y'all see us on the cb or anything my dad's handle is gear jammer and mine's snowman Speaking of snowman, the snowman is going to get off the phone and about to go eat, boy. Man, I'm starving. <laughs> so what is he doing? Oh, that's why he's about to be cutting the dang grass. Well, excuse me, cutting the leaves. I swear, man. We literally got so much stained leaves on here, dude. We can... We can probably build a leaf pile taller than this freaking truck we got so much leaves <laughs> but guys uh like this video uh favorite cut on that notifications thing on favorite and uh yeah we'll see y'all the next video peace